If you ever want to migrate from an iPhone to a Samsung phone, you may need to transfer your WhatsApp data between them. But the problem is that your iPhone backs up WhatsApp data on Apple iCloud, while Samsung devices back up WhatsApp data on Google Drive. This made it nearly impossible to transfer WhatsApp chats between the two devices over the internet. Luckily, with the help of Samsung Smart Switch app, it's now possible to locally transfer WhatsApp data between these two devices using a USB-C to Lightning cable. If you are using an iPhone 11 or any newer model, you may already have this cable. There is another thing to remember. Make sure your Samsung phone is running on Android 12 or newer versions. Now please follow the steps to transfer WhatsApp messages from iPhone to Samsung. First of all, if you already installed WhatsApp from Play Store on your Samsung phone, you have to uninstall it because WhatsApp will be automatically installed during the data transfer process. Now, on your Samsung phone, go to Settings, Accounts and Backup. Select Bring Data from Old Device. It will launch the Samsung Smart Switch app. Tap Continue. Then allow all the permissions. Now you will be asked, what should this phone do? Select Receive Data. Then select iPhone or iPad as the source device. Now, connect your Samsung phone to the iPhone using USB-C to Lightning cable. The iPhone will give you a pop-up asking if you want to trust this computer. Select Trust. It will allow your iPhone to transfer data through the cable. Once the two devices are connected, it now asks you to select which data you want to transfer, like calls and contacts, messages, apps, settings, images, videos, audios and documents. I'd suggest you select everything so that you do not miss any important files sent over WhatsApp. Only make sure your Samsung phone has enough storage space that is at least equal to or more than the total storage space currently being used in your iPhone. Tap on Transfer. Smart Switch now asks which app you want to install on the Samsung phone. For this guide, we are interested in WhatsApp. So select WhatsApp and uncheck any other apps. You will now get a QR code on your Samsung phone. To start the transfer process, you can scan the QR code with your iPhone. Or you can simply go to WhatsApp settings on your iPhone, select chats, then tap on move chats to Android. Now the transfer process should start. Depending on the data you are transferring, this process may take some time. So please wait until the process is complete. Once the transfer process is finished, tap on go to the home screen. It will take you another 10 to 15 minutes to organize the transferred data. After you get the data transfer complete notification, you can follow the further steps. You should see the WhatsApp app is automatically installed on your device. Open WhatsApp. You have to log in with the same phone number that was used to log into WhatsApp on your iPhone. It will send a verification code to your WhatsApp app on your iPhone. Just enter the code here. After login, WhatsApp will automatically detect the chat backup on your Samsung phone and prompt you to import your chat history. Just select start to restore your WhatsApp data. You should now have all your chats, images, videos and other WhatsApp data on your Samsung phone. After successful migration, you will get this message on your iPhone that WhatsApp is not registered on this device. It's okay, as you can now continue your conversations on your Samsung device. So friends, this is how you can successfully migrate your WhatsApp data from your iPhone to your Samsung phone. As you have seen, it's a straightforward process. The entire transfer takes place locally through the cable, so you're not required to use Google Drive, iCloud or any other online services.